paintbrush. Wetting it. I missed. I'm gonna use a viewfinder, sorry. I always look in there anyways. I'm gonna rinse that off. Pad dry. Okay, then next we have a toner. I have used this before. I will be using a cotton swab to apply it. Okay, so today the products that I used were sent from Bolden, but this isn't like a sponsor video at all. Um, I'm just trying things out, and the things that I actually used today were the toner, and I've used the toner and the SPF and the clarifying wash before, but I didn't film a video. But yes, I'll tell you my thoughts after I show her them. Did I, say that? did I show this already? Here's the toner. I think I did show this already. This toner is very strong, obviously, but I meant in like scent. Like also the perfume is pretty high up in this. Not pretty high up, but there's still perfume in it and I don't want perfume in my toner specifically, so I can't use this. Also, my skin is sensitive, like really sensitive, so I used it twice, <laughs> but probably not going to be using that again. I'll, give, I'll be giving that to somebody. What else did I use? I used this clarifying cleanser. Once again, this has perfume in it, and the perfume is like... Eight. It's the eighth ingredient in this long line of ingredients. You know, like some people don't mind. For my sensitive skin, I do. So I won't be using this again because I did break, not break out. I just got like the little race, race, what is it called? Bumps. Texture. I got texture. 
So yes, it could be because I was using both of these and they're both pretty strong on my specific skin. So yes, I won't be using these anymore, but I will be giving them to someone else. Everything else I used, I love. Like this, oh my goodness. This feels like actual water on your skin and it is very hydrating. And I don't really know where the perfume is in this, but I love it so much. This is amazing. I will be using this again. And this, SPF. SPF is amazing for you no matter. Like people think that just because you're more melanated that you don't need to wear SPF, but that's wrong. You do need to wear SPF just because you can't see your sunburn as easily as you can with someone who's a lighter skin doesn't mean anything. You need to use SPF and this is SPF 30 so I like it. It's, pretty, it's not as low as SPF 15. Like it's a pretty good SPF. I like it and it also feels very hydrating. That's the only thing I have on my face still and I still have a glow. So I really like this and oh I was sent this as well but I haven't tried it. Oh no this is a spot treatment. I love this. This is absolutely, uh, there's like a glare because like the window's right there, but it says overnight spot treatment. This is amazing. I love this. This is my favorite product. It really does work and it works so well. What else do I have? Oh, the glycolic acid. Did not use this yet, but I will be using it. What is it for? Face dark spots. Okay, I'll be trying this tonight. When you have skincare that's specifically formulated for people of color, it's especially amazing to be a person of color using them because for things like glycolic, glycolic acid or things that fade dark circles, it's, it's just specially formulated for people who tend to get darker or have hyperpigmentation in places. That's what I meant to say, have hyperpigmentation. So it's really great to have skincare especially formulated for us and it's also cruelty free did I say that yes it's cruelty free so if you're into the humane side of skincare check them out it's amazing I like check out everything I did not mention this this is the Shea oil and vitamin E I cannot use this on my face but it can be used on your body and hair so I will be trying this on my hair and body um, I'm allergic to vitamin E so can't use that this was a really cool brand to try it's black owned of course need to support black owned businesses also I'll be leaving their Instagram link down below so you can check them out they're really cool a lot of people wave rave about their products so if you then if you saw me using the item that, that didn't quite mesh well with me and you want to see if it'll work for others go look on their Instagram a lot of people love their products they're really they have a lot of customer satisfaction so go look at their Instagram I'll be linking petitions you can sign to help support other people like me people of color I'm gonna be leaving links to things that you can do petitions maybe donation thingies if I can find any but yes petitions specifically especially to this band this band this man sold the KKK police officers um yes so do I really do I need to touch on black Lives matter I'm a black creator if you need me to tell you why I deserve to live that's on you I hope you enjoyed. If this is your first time seeing me, hi. I hope you liked it. Bye. Adios. I didn't speak Spanish in this video, but I will sometime soon. Hasta luego. Um, buen provecho.